Hello, sweet and welcome back again to my channel. This is Lady B Kitchen. How is my lovely friends doing today? I hope you guys are doing good. Today's video, guys, is another Ogbonga uh, video. Today, we'll be cooking one of the best soup we have in Nigeria called Agbola soup. I believe 99% of Nigerians eat this soup so because this is one of our general soup everybody like to eat this soup because this soup is very very good for health and it's very very simple to make so this agbolo soup is one of the soup you will like to eat and then come back for it another day because it's very very good to go so while eating this soup you will not regret it and while making this soup you will not regret it so let's see the few ingredients that we'll be needing on this video Making this agbolo soup, all the ingredients that I will be using is ready and everything is here. So all the names of the ingredients, I'm going to list it in my description box. Don't forget to check it out. So these are all the ingredients I use. I have palm oil, that is called red oil. I have bitter leaf, so I'll be making use of bitter leaf. So I prefer bitter leaf instead of a pumpkin leaf. So I'll be making use of bitter leaf. Then I have my agbolo, so that is the chairman of the occasion, so the agbolo have already blend. Then the blended ingredient, I blend crayfish, hot pepper, onions and ginger and garlic, so that is the blended ingredient I blend together. Then for the fish, I have dry fish, so that is my smoked fish, so I will be making use of smoked fish. I'm going to list all the names in my description box, don't forget to check it out. First thing to do while making your agbolo soup, you have to first of all mix your agbolo with your palm oil, that is your red oil. So you have to first of all mix both of them together. Now I just turn my palm oil inside a bigger bowl. So now I will just turn in the agbolo so then I will stay. So I have to mix this until everything goes mixed. This step is very, very important. If you don't want to mix the agbolo with your hand, you can as well put a little bit of hot water in the fire. Then add the bowl of the agbolo inside the hot water. Before 5 minutes, it will still get mixed. So now after mixing, this is how it looks. The next thing I will be doing is to turn the stock water inside my cooking pot. So this is the stock water that I use to cook my protein. So that is the same water that I will be using to cook the soup. So now I just turn in the stock water then I will add in my blended ingredient. After adding in the blended ingredient then I will add in my seasoning cubes. So here, here I have two seasoning cubes. So this is the two seasoning cubes I will be using. So I just open the seasoning cubes. I will add it inside then add in a little bit of salt to taste. Then stir everything together until everything gets combined. This point you can as well add your agbolo, but you can as well leave it to turn to boil. But me, I leave mine to turn to boil. So now it's already turned to boil. So I will add in the agbolo. So here is the agbolo. Then I will pour everything inside. At this point, I will not stir the soup until eight to ten minutes. So all I will do, I will just let this to turn to boil about eight to ten minutes before I will give it a stir. So I will now add my spoon inside and will not stir it for now. After 10 minutes, so this is how it looks. So now it's time for me to stir. So I have to stir everything together. After stirring, then I will start adding in my protein. Just look how this agbolo is pumping, guys. Just look at this. So I will just stir it together at this moment. You see that? So after stirring it, I will now add in my protein. So it's time to add in the protein so that everything we cook together. So here is the protein. I will turn everything inside the soup. Cooking this soup, you can use any protein of your choice. Anything you think that is good for you to eat, you can as well use it while making this soup. So it's very very good to go so now i just add in my smoked chicken and the, i just add in the fried chicken too so i will just stir everything together then let everything to get combined i 
after adding that next is to add in the dry fish so i just add in the smoked fish so i will still stir everything together actually guys i'm the one that smoked this fish by myself so this is what i always do anytime i want to dry fish i always smoke it by myself so it's very good and it's very very helpful if you want to see the video how i smoke the fish or how i smoke my fish just drop it in the comment section i will find the video out because it's very very good and very very helpful if you can be smoking your fish at home it's very very good for you so this is what i always do so i really like it a lot and i appreciate it a lot after stirring the soup this is how it looks so next thing to do is to wash our bitter leaf so now it's time to wash the bitter leaf before adding your bitter leaf inside you have to make sure you wash it with clean water so now i will be washing my with hot water so i just pour in the hot water then i will use this hot water to soak the bitter leaf about 10 to 15 minutes before i will wash with cold water it's very very important to wash your bitter leaf with hot water instead of cold water first because if you wash it with hot water it will make you to see the sand because this bitter leaf always carries sand you understand so if you wash it with hot water all the sand will come out but when you wash it with cold, uh, cold water it will not come out like that so that is the reason why you have to first of all wash it with hot water before washing with cold water so now i'm done washing the bitter leaf it's time to add it inside the soup just look at our bowl of soup look how this is pumping guys just tell me you are not going to give this a try just talk i'm not make it here so this one at the Best way when you go take cook your agbolo soup for her. Just look at this soup, guys. Just tell me what you not go eat with this your agbolo soup. Look at this agbolo soup. This one I went to the call. Chop one, chop two. Come back for terry. So it's very very good to go. You not go get tired while eating this kind of soup. This kind of soup, my people, if they eat them, you know, go feel get tired, they lie, lie. You go like make it come back again for again and again. Because this one, a soup, when it goes, just sit down. You can eat anything when they're hungry, you at a moment. So, this one, our soup is getting ready, it's getting ready. So, I will be stirring so that everything will be pumping together. Look at our fish, everything is combining. So, now, so it just reached my people. So, the soup, now, what would they call? One in a million. I'm just giving it five minutes to cook more so after five minutes so this is how it looks so I just load the gas after five minutes this is how it looks so at this point I'm going to turn off the gas because the soup is ready now everything has been cooked and everything is ready I will just stir then turn off the gas because it's ready to go like it's calling for plate it say you can bring your plate because I am ready to go so that is it my people i enjoy this soup so much because this one now the soup when you go like it guys you go come back again for another plate because this soup too too sweet it's too sweet my people because i like a bowl of soup so much i like it so so much so i see make i bring this one for our table make we just see how simple when you go to make your abolo soup for us so just more ingredients your abolo soup is being cooked so that is it my people this one we are done for this video and this is our abolo soup those days in nigeria once my mom cooked this kind of soup what i like to eat it most is agidi hi my people if you chop this kind of soup with agidi eh, you will come back again for it because it's very very good and delicious as in both of them go together so i like agbola soup and agidi so so much so that is it guys so now this one is going down with meda or atta so this is what we eat here so that is what i will be using to download this my agbola soup so it's ready and it's ready to eat i just take out the ones we are going to eat at the moment so that is it for now look at this soup guys just take a good look at this soup subscribe to my channel guys if you are new to my channel, this is your first time coming across my channel. You are highly, highly welcome to the Bonga family. This one is the channel for the cook food. Cook anything cook food, anything cookable now here for the cook -up. So you are highly, highly welcome to the Bonga family. We appreciate, we honor you. We thank you so much for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe, share our video, and drop your 
comment how you feel about our video make we they see you every time make we they see your comment make we they see your share and if you share my video don't forget to drop it in the comment section that you share me and just leave the rest for me how i'm going to thank you and don't forget to like my video bye bye